So a couple of people have asked me about the uh, new uh, Tetra Pineapple Wi-Fi Pineapple Tetra case I built. Um, I travel with the fine, uh, Wi-Fi Pineapple Tetra a lot. Um, I use it on travels, uh, on engagements, and every time I had it in a different case, I had to pull it out, set it up, you know, uh, connect the cables, and then when I'm done, put it back in the case and go. I wanted to uh, make that process a little bit easier. So um, I looked around, I've built a couple other um, different types of cases, but um, I ended up on this solution. Uh, this is a, actually a, a GoPro camera case. Um, hold on, let me just add the exposure a bit. Let's see, make it a little bit, yeah. So uh, it's a GoPro camera case um, that I found on Amazon. It had the right size and the depth that I needed. Um, it's actually a hard case. Uh, but it's a foam core, so uh, just grab a utility blade and you can actually cut through the case, which I've done so that it fits the Wi-Fi Pineapple Tetra perfectly. Um, so now when I'm on the road or when I'm, you know, um, when I need to use it, I'll just put it down, you know, I open up the case, open it up, and that's everything I need for my, uh, for my using the Tetra. I've added some um, l shape uh, 90 degrees uh, antenna cable uh, connectors. So now I can just pop out these antennas like that um, and it's ready to go. Now the idea is that I will have a uh, Ethernet connection. I can just plug it in and then I'm done. Um, so when, I, when I'm done with it, I can just fold it back in and then close it. Unplug the cables, zip it up and I'm ready to go. Um, so inside this case there are a couple things, um, this is an anchor battery, um, it has two ports on it, I think it's called the PowerCore Plus series, um, they have a couple batteries, you have to be careful, but this one has enough uh, output to run the Tetra off the battery using the Y cable. Um, I've test run it for or continuous scanning on both channels, uh, 2.4 and 5. And ran for about 10 hours, so it's pretty easy, uh, decent mileage. Um, then I have this uh, anchor uh, charger. This has a 24. I don't know if you can see it actually. It has a 24 um, 24 um, watt output. Um, so this will also run the Tetra. The catch is you have to use two USB cables. Uh, you can't use the white cable. Uh, but if you have two USB cables, you can just connect to either the USB, the serial, or the Ethernet uh, port, whichever uh, combination of it. Um, you need 18 watts, so um, you need to run two cables. But it will run the, uh, the Tetra. And I can use this to charge my battery. So it's one adapter. get to use both ways. Um, so inside here, there's a mesh pocket where I have some more stuff. So I have a, basically some cables. You know, the white cable, some extra uh, mic. I have a pen, uh, notepad, uh, and extra um, alpha adapter uh, with the antenna. So that goes all in there. Um, I also have a flashlight here because I always end up like looking for flashlights. So I always like to keep a flashlight in any of the pouches that I build. So once I'm done, you know, plug the cables in, zip it up, close it up, ready to go again.